All right, PC Addicts here. We're gonna do a. I'm just gonna do a short one on some of the features I use on XChat. I don't know if anybody cares to know, but some of the things I find that work quite well. Um, I have a colored theme going, and I set some things up where if somebody puts a sentence with my name on it, watch somebody go ahead and type something with my name in it real quick. Um, I have it highlighting it all in yellow, so that way if there's a ton of ton of people chatting at once and then somebody mentions my name there you go thank you AJ um, highlights the whole thing yellow uh, one of the my favorite things of course and a lot of clients are is the tab completion so if I pick someone's name like over here we got a list of current users that are uh, in this channel the PC Addicts channel let's let's choose broken shovel he's got kind of a long name I don't want to type his whole name I'm gonna go I'll just take type the first couple letters I could even just type the first letter hit tab and then it'll start scrolling through all the B names. I'll hit tab again, there's Broken Shovel. And I'll just start typing like, yo, yo, yo. Since I say that all the time, and people are probably sick of seeing it. Hit enter and boom. You can also do that in the middle of a sentence. Like, uh, hey, B, there's Broken Shovel, yo, yo, yo. Or Blizzy, go Blizzy, yo, yo. Um, tab completion, I use that all the time, it's great. What else we got? Uh, blah, blah, blah. People, someone asked me today, it was Miles asked me today about how I so quickly copy uh, a sentence or, or, or post that they do. And I just highlight it real quick and then I just control V. And when I control V, it, it automatically copies it when you highlight it. So right now it's copied to my clipboard. All I gotta do is control V. Um, another thing I do is when I do that, like let's say, what do we got here? We got. Let's copy that one, control V. I'll push space. I'll do the, oops, the close end sign, or less than sign, sorry. Um, and then hyphen, hyphen. And when I hit space, it automatically converts. Well, you'll see it. Um, actually, no, the way I have it set up for quickness, I go uh, less than sign, then the period. And then I hit space, it automatically puts it in. I mean, I guess it's the same amount. But anyways, now that I look at it. <laughs> but anyways, I have it convert into a little icon. So then I go, ha, ha, ha. And then what pops up is this little icon that shows up. Also, I can do the, I got a few smileys in there or emoticons or however you call it. I don't even know the proper term. So if I do that or do the little wink or the, what is the tongue thing? Nope. There it is. Or the sad face. There you go. See, I'll go like this, and then I'll go real quick. I'll go boom, boom, and I go, oops, haha. -ha. And that's about it. But basically, that's how I have it set up. Also, next chat, if you, let's say, you, let's say you're connected to a lot of channels like I am within the Great Shark Network, I want to move this one to the top. Or if I just want to scroll through them real quick with my keyboard, I hold down Control, press the Page Up key, boom, and then I can scroll through all my channels real quick and quickly get to either private message or whatever. Let's say I want to move this one up to the top or down to the bottom so that can kind of group my channels together. I hold down shift and control, press page up, page down, and I can move the actual channel up and down in the list. Um, what else? Uh, Chris D. See, Miles, Miles put my name in it so I highlighted it and plus it beeped at me. Watch, say my name a few more times. You'll hear it beep through the stream. Someone will do it. I know they will. I have faith. I don't know. If there he goes. All right. See? 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 <laughs> but anyways, up. Oh, no. See, that wasn't proper. He didn't. He didn't do the tab completion or something. Okay. Okay. <laughs> so there we go. Uh, anything else in here? Uh, of course, if you right-click a name, you can, you know, do stuff. Open dialog window means basically means private chat. So I can do a private chat with cool dude. I'll go ahead and close that. Also, I guess you can detach it. Let's say for Slack stuff, I want to actually put him and keep an eye on him or keep an eye on his channel all the time. I can deta detach his channel and it opens up another window so I can basically split my screen and have a couple channels up at the same time. But I don't care to do that too often. I'll just switch. I'm faster at switching uh, using control and page up and page down. Um, so. Uh, where's detach or attach window? So then I attach it back down in there. So that's about it, really. Um, background. How did you set the background? Okay, good question, Miles. 
to set the background, I just right click, or actually, you can use the things up here, or you can right click it, but right click, go to settings, preferences, background image. Bada bing, bada boom, and then there's some of my background images. Um, also, I did use colored nicknames, but uh, I did install a colored theme that helped manage the colors a little bit, but I had to change a couple. Again, I had to change my message alerts so that way I can see it all. This is becoming a long recording. I apologize. But if you're still watching, then hey, good for you. Topic, recording a show. There you go. Now the topic has changed. All right, guys. Thanks for hanging out. And let me switch back and go bada bing, bada boom.